I'm going to take this plain standard door that came with the house and I'm going to make a secret door. Every secret bookcase door needs to have books, but I want something to be extremely light. This is styrofoam packing foam. I've used my T-square to mark off where I want the books and cut it to the width of the door. I'm gonna begin to form this into fake books. got a mold that we're doing portable foam in to make the wood pieces. We're using this black foam it for it's left over from another project and its shelf life is about to expire so we're using it to make all of the molding. Portable foam has set up and removing it from the mold you can see we've got a nice imprint of carved wood. I have this mold that we got from Nepal. I'm going to use it and cast this statue on the doorknob. I'll actually take the doorknob off and cast it so that the doorknob becomes a statue for our secret door. I've started to lay out my shelves and I've marked off where each shelf will be. Next step cover these in material. The books will be covered in material and epoxy. To do my book bindings, I take regular paper and wrap it in tissue paper, tape it down, and put that into our printer. That way I'm able to print out the book covers on this tissue paper. And then when you decoupage this on to the styrofoam books, it conforms a lot better than regular paper. And some of the texture from the material that you coated the styrofoam in shows through to give it a little bit more realism. Got the door painted black. I'm doing some one point perspective so that I can kind of faux trump loy some shelves back here. I've got some lines using my T-square and I just am coming in with my shelves. Got our faux book background in. I've started on our faux books. There's still some paint that has to be done on those and some trimming. Our bookshelf's moving right along. I coated the book styrofoam in material and epoxy and then I laminated on some book bindings. After I finished decoupaging on the book bindings, they still needed a little bit of paint to tie them all together and to fill in the seams and add a little bit of dimension with shadow. Uh, so I'm, I'm going through and blending in the colors so that they look more natural. I have attached with epoxy the books and the um, molding to the door. I'm letting it all set up. All of the books have things that we have worked on in the past. And there's little hints to our life all in the names of the books. And our little tchotchkes. I've always wanted a secret door. And this is our hallway. And you go in this way, and the doorknob is hidden. You have to remove this and then turn the statue, and you're inside. That's my secret doorway into our library.